Elgin. I'm an education producer at Blue Ridge PBS Echo. So for today's Out and About, Harrison and I, say hi Harrison. Hi Harrison. <laughs> so for today's Out and About, Harrison and I are going on a hike to Mill Mountain. I'm just right up to the star. It's super beautiful. It was recommended to me by multiple people. But of course, before we go up there, we gotta get some fuel. So we're gonna head to Donnie D's Bagels and Bada Top because we're still craving those Lynchburg bagels and Donnie D's delivers. They are amazing. Harrison got a pork roll um, breakfast bagel the other week. And it's really hard to find pork roll down in Virginia, at least in this part. Um, this is for any of my Pennsylvania, New Jersey, or New York people who get that pork roll or Taylor ham. And then after we get Donnie D's, we're gonna go to my, well, one of my favorite coffee places in Roanoke um, called Sweet Donkey Coffee. I am a sucker for their iced white mochas. They're so good. And it's really nice because Sweet Donkey is really at the base of Mill Mountain. So it's gonna be like a five minute drive from there to the starting point of where we need to go. So come along with us and let's get hiking. got a open face bagel and I got a fried egg with cheese and onion and chives cream cheese on an everything bagel and then of course Harrison got his pork roll sandwich on a jalapeno cheddar bagel super awesome that Donnie's had it and this is gonna be a permanent staple for us look how good they both look so cheesy and melted and the bagels are so good your pet on a leash. No, Coco needs to be on a leash. Okay, so hikers yield to horseback riders, bikers need to yield to horseback riders, and bikers yield to hikers. So everyone yields, you have the right away, you got a horse with you. So we think we're right here. Um, we should be right here at least, because we didn't go off Riverland Ave. So that means that this is a more <laughs> this is a more difficult trail. It's more difficult. It's not easy, but it's more difficult. And we're going to take this up. No, we're not. We're going to come right here. Oh, we're going to go right there. Up on that trail. Okay, and we'll go up. You can tell I don't hike that often. <laughs> okay, let's do this. Trail conditions to be fair today, which is understandable because we did have some rain recently. A lot of rain. Okay, so we got to the trailhead. We're walking up it now. Um, we don't hike that often. Harrison has hiked well more than I have in my entire life. You have gone a more, yeah, you've gone on more hikes than I have. Who says well more? <sighs> Whatever, we've gone on more hikes than I have. Um, we've done McAfee's Knob when we were first together. 
and that was <laughs> brutal for me. But um, do you want to go on the wood thrush trail or do you want to do the star trail? <laughs> okay, 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 I just want to make sure. Um, so I read that this is going to take about an hour and a half to two hours. Hopefully an hour and a half. Um, but yeah, definitely we'll have a very pretty view once we get to the top. So this is 0.24 miles. And then once we actually get to the trail, it's like 1.38 miles. Okay. Yeah, another thing, we bought bug spray because my legs got eaten up a couple weeks ago during a family photo shoot. I was taking someone else's photos and oh my gosh, I at least have 20 bug bites on one leg. It was not fun. So bug spray is a must. And we did put on sunscreen too. Gotta be safe in the summer. About this hike is that the elevation climbs like 738 or 48 feet for the whole hike so right now it's pretty flat but it is going to get a little bit more steep this trail is there's a lot of benches along the way so if you're getting kind of tired or out of breath you can just go ahead and take a little rest. So I'm adding a photo of what poison ivy looks like along with another photo in a little bit that you'll see here as well of poison oak and another plant that you shouldn't touch. So always be checking and watching where you're walking whenever you do a hike because you never know. And always take a shower when you're done hiking just in case if you did accidentally touch something that you weren't supposed to. back down.
just got done with our Mill Mountain Star hike. It was good. It definitely was a workout for us. Um, how'd you like it, Harrison? It wasn't bad. Yeah, uh, we definitely need to hike more in the future. I mean, this part of Virginia offers so many beautiful sights, you know, just so that you can appreciate it and um, enjoy nature's beauty. But thanks for coming along with us. In the meantime, I'll see y'all around. Bye, y'all.